Hello and hi everybody, welcome back to another one of this time. I'm back at it with another one from SML Theory. And this one is SML uh, FNAF 6 uh, Speculation. If it comes out, lol. That's what was in the title, lol. <laughs> um, if you were to ask me, do I think SML FNAF uh, Pizzeria Simulator or P FNAF 6, however you want to say it, if do I think it will come out? Maybe, but not anytime soon. Not anytime soon. Me personally, if Logan wants to make another FNAF video, he will probably not want to do it for like another year. Or maybe at least the end of this year. Like me personally, I, th I feel like he might want to do one for like Halloween. Maybe that will be like a good time to make a FNAF video. But other than that, I don't think he plans on doing another FNAF video anytime soon. So, but we can just, we can make some theories. We can make some speculations on if it will be a real thing or not. But we'll just see. Only time can tell us if that will actually happen. It'll be cool if it happened, but I highly doubt it will happen anytime soon. So with that being said, if you haven't yet subscribed to SML Theory, then be sure to go subscribe. The link to the original is in the description. So with that being said, let's get into this. <laughs> Oh, Five Nights at Freddy's 6 is coming soon, or maybe not. At no. the end of the fifth episode, Brooklyn Guy says that five videos of FNAF is enough. With the cost of the FNAF videos increasing, games seem to be getting crazier and more detailed, and on top of that, the costumes and sets make filming incredibly time-consuming. No, I think we're done here. I think five is enough. These are getting way too expensive, and the games just keep getting dumber, and honestly, I... <laughs> I just don't care anymore. I mean, I'm done. I mean, I'm tired. This this takes so long to do every time. I mean, it's just, this is, we're good. This is, this is enough. Which was expressed by Logan in a recent vlog on Chili's channel called I Am Too Stressed Out, mm. where people criticized the ending of Sister's Location, in which Logan says that he's burned out from doing the Five Nights at Freddy's videos. Yeah. A lot of things are going wrong. Um, so, you know, I uploaded Sister's Location, and that's not doing good because, you know, obviously, people didn't like the ending which i'm sorry about that but i explained to you guys that we kind of burn out of doing the five nights at freddy videos which means we might not actually get a five nights and freddy's videos at least for a yeah, while maybe saying. a few years just because logan is worried about other things like all of his channels including the new sml gaming channel and chili's vlog channel a lot of things going his on. daughter and trying to consistently upload on all of those channels and editing and filming for the main channel but since the series is well received by fans with the second episode brooklyn guy mentions the success of the first episode and that it got millions of views and that they would make more he'll be fine hey look maybe if you come with us for the third night you can see for yourself we're not gonna go back for a third night <laughs> oh, i think we're gonna be going back for a third night you see that yeah. see those numbers see how crazy that is yeah you can't beat that but since they are now burned out from making any more videos they'll probably take a little break from making anything five nights at freddy's related yeah. and focus on other stuff but we could possibly see a teaser of the next five nights at freddy's video in if you're someone that Jesus suffers from having fucking cries and uh, god damn i don't care i already have good toothpaste you can fuck off and shove that up your goddamn app as Logan did before to build up hype for the past videos. And because Logan has been following the orders of the games with no specific hints at the end of the fifth episode, I believe the next FNAF video will revolve around Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator, which could follow the stories and mechanics of the game, as seen in previous videos like Five Nights at Freddy's 3, which is a primary example of Logan bringing back an old character, Mr. Winkle, while at the same time relating to the story of William Afton, but with its own spin to it. <laughs> Right there. Who are you? Hey there. Mr. Winkle! Listen, I didn't mean to kill those five kids and shove their bodies inside the I thought, truck. I thought, Sorry. What are you talking about? I thought you Mr. Winkle was going to be in the sister location, but he never was. I opened Freddy Fazbear's Pizza many years ago, and there was this little girl's birthday party. And in Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria, the game, you build your own pizzeria while at the same time scraping old animatronics found in the alley for part, with old animatronics like Circus Baby, now called Scrap Baby, and Springtrap, now called Scrap Trap making a reappearance from the past five nights at freddy's video i've said this before but i'll say it again i've never played pizzeria simulator like i just i never really got interested in that game like like at that time i think at that by that time i was already like over the fnaf series i was already like playing other stuff and i kind of got love it the fuck <laughs> and i kind of um 
played other games, didn't really care about FNAF that much at that point. So I saw Pizzeria Simulator at a couple occasions and I'm just like, what is that? That just, it, it didn't really treat me that much. So I never played the game ever. So I don't know anything about the game. And both of these costumes could make reappearances because they were used in previous Five Nights at Freddy's videos and we see that the circus baby animatronic was untouched and that the spring trap head was actually in the scoop room. And mm -hmm. so they wouldn't have to take too much time about making new costumes for both of them. Ennard yeah, also makes sense. an appearance in this game, but in a different form as Molten Freddy. And after Baby left, Ennard had to rebuild itself using Funtime Freddy pieces. What, Marvin, what is that? Y'all better run. Ah, Marvin, what the f is that? What is that thing? Which would mean that they can reuse the same costumes they used in Sister Location, but with just different appearance. And another yeah. animatronic called Lefty, Lauren Capsulate Fuse Transport Extract, Lefty. whose purpose was to catch the puppet from FNAF 2 inside of him, was also part of Henry's plan to set free all the souls in the animatronics. And since they can reuse a few of the animatronics for these characters, it'll help get rid of a lot of the work so that Logan and the crew can just focus on the set. And speaking of the set, since Pizzeria Simulator, you get to imagine the restaurant like it's your own by buying products such as cups and plates and you could add stuff like a ball pit or even more animatronics. And Logan could film this video in the same place where the first episode took place. The problem with sister location was that it was way more complex than an office which was in the previous games but they can yeah. reuse the office from the first video while at the same time using the other parts of the building to make the pizzeria. Uh -huh. And also it would be way easier to recreate the office because it uses vents which lead to the player having to defend himself from the animatronics while doing the tasks at the same time. Mm -hmm. There were also multiple segments in the game, like customizing the restaurant, salvaging the animatronics, or doing tasks in the office. And since there are a lot of segments in the game, it could be a great opportunity to bring other characters like Junior, Joseph, and Cody to also help with Brooklyn Guy's plan. And yeah. after their last experience at Five Nights at Freddy's 3, and also technically 4 in Jeffy's Dream, they'll most likely want to help with Brooklyn Guy's plan because they want to let the souls free while at the same time time ending their experience at Freddy Fazbear's and since SML took a different approach in the fifth episode Brooklyn guy opening the sister location instead of Mr. Winkle who is pretty much William Afton of the series he left me a buttload of cash and guess what I spent it on what I opened up a brand new Freddy Fazbear's pizzeria why would you do that the last place tried to kill us multiple times yeah well don't worry this place is going to be way better because I opened a sister location dun 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 in SML, Brooklyn Guy could be the one to open the pizzeria. And for the scenario, Brooklyn Guy could open a new restaurant with Jeffy and Mario obviously disapproving of it because of what happened in Sister Location when he built a restaurant before and not wanting yeah. to go back. But and Brooklyn the time Guy would explain that. to Jeffy and Marvin that his plan to trap Mr. Winkle, who embodied Springtrap, and the other animatronics like the puppet, Baby, and all the others, is to set all their souls free while also killing Mr. Winkle in the process so that he doesn't murder anymore kids and put them in animatronics and since jeffy has been pretty much the main character for this series except for brooklyn guy we can definitely see him helping brooklyn guy kill off the animatronics for one final time there's also the rockstar animatronics which are revamped animatronic models from the original game and even though zach and oh, valerie used the them. original five nights at freddy's animatronics for five nights at freddy's four they can probably still reuse those costumes by adding another layer and to get rid of the nightmare look we could also see brooklyn guy mention that he lost penelope I mean, yeah, one of them did eat my daughter, but that's her fault because she didn't shock him fast enough. Since in Sister Location, Baby and the other Funtime animatronics all turn into Ennard, who later used Michael Afton's body to escape the restaurant. But in the video, that didn't even happen because Brooklyn Guy, Mario, and Jeffy were able to escape before being scooped. Run, Marvin, run, run! Yeah. Oh my god. I don't care about fucking CBS, bitch. I care more about fun FNAF. You can take that hair, cut it up, and shut up, shut it up, fuck it. <laughs> Run! What is it? What were you pointing at? What'd you lose? I can help you find it. Why does Marvin, Ennard I think sound they're pretty gay? distracted. I think we can leave at a pretty leisurely pace. Come on. Ugh, okay, we're finally back in the elevator. Let me just push the down button. Yeah, I really gotta work on those doors.
However, they could have still escaped, but when looking for Penelope at the location, Brooklyn guy couldn't find her, which caused him to go to Marvin for help. And instead of letting Penelope go, they could somehow get her soul back into her original body with an invention by just having her body near the restaurant. And in the ending, there was a message that Henry left for the animatronics. He was talking to his daughter, Charlotte Emily, while also talking to his old friend, William Afton, telling him that he deserves a lot of bad because of what he's done. But we can instead see see a similar concept to this, but instead it will be Brooklyn guy talking to Mr. Winkle about how scummy he is and he deserves what's coming for him. However, Jeez. we can maybe see a different character come with Brooklyn guy, since Mario and Jeffy might not want to go, especially because they were main characters in the sister location video, so to change things up, they could bring Chef Pee Pee, because we've seen most of the main characters in Five Nights at Freddy's videos, and he himself had experience with animatronics a long time ago yeah. in the Chef Pee Pee quit it's series, and he actually did a pretty Pee -Pee good job, where Goodman told him that there was a new job to work at a Freddy Fazbear's pizzeria, and Chef PB asks how much it'll pay, and Goodman says about a hundred a week. I actually found you another job. What? What? Yeah, it's at this uh this pizza restaurant called Freddy Fazbear's. Oh, that's cool. Well, um, what do I have to do there? Well, you're gonna be the the night watch security guard. You're gonna report at midnight, and uh, you just kind of patrol the area, make sure everything's going well as planned. And uh, they actually had quite a few other security guards before you, but they all went missing. So. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, they asked me if you would join, so I said... That's a good uh, idea. Oh, about $100 a week. Uh, $100 a week? Yeah. Uh. Which is better than what they paid Jeffy of $3.20. And after a few hours, Jeffy B arrives at the pizzeria, and on the first night, he sees bloody writings and a corpse, and sees that animatronics move from their place on the stage. When what the happened to those out, animatronics? Freddy then those scares cool. them and starts to drag Jeff P. P. away. Where did, Imagine they use those ones. Go? Oh, where did it go? <laughs> that he could die, Chef Pee begs Freddy and Chica not to kill him, but they ended up only wanting to give him pizza. What if and they just made of those this, like Chef Pee Pee goes with Brooklyn guy like to the, the new puppets. pizzeria, Instead he just might like trigger his old suit. memories and think that this new place will be just like his last experience. And if SML sticks with the story of the original games and has Brooklyn guy go with his plan and convinces Chef Pee Pee to be the business owner of the pizzeria until he burns the place, this would cause Chef Pee Pee to get emotional about owning a restaurant, even if it's just for a little bit. But we'll only have to wait and see what SML is going to do for the next Five Nights at Freddy's video, and that's even if they do one. But let me know what your theory is, or if I missed anything, down in the comments. Thanks for watching, subscribe, and click on this video here. I mean, the chances of Logan making um, a FNAF 6 or FNAF Pizzeria Simulator, whatever the hell you're going to call it, uh, video, the chances are low because he has mentioned he's burnt out from the videos. He wants to do other things. He has a lot of other things he has to focus on especially when he just started the gaming channel so i highly doubt he'll do the video anytime soon um at least later this year i highly doubt he'll do it maybe within the next couple of years he can probably do it if he decides to do it but i don't know but it would be cool if he does it um i mean pizzeria simulator now that i'm like learning about it a bit it does sound a bit interesting i might have to check that game out at some point i wonder if it's available on playstation I haven't played Sister Location yet on PlayStation. I haven't even finished FNAF 4, nor 3, nor 2, because I just gave up on those games. Maybe I should I should live stream myself playing those games. Do you guys want me to live stream myself playing Sister Location, or do you want me to just break it up into episodes? Or what if I what if I just make one giant episode? I don't know. I was thinking about streaming it, but I thought episodes would be better. I don't really know. I'll let you guys decide in the comments if... If you guys decide to comment on the video, I highly doubt this would get it that much comments, but I'll figure it out some point in the future. So with that being said, if you did enjoy this, then be sure to give this video a like. If you haven't yet subscribed, then be sure to do this right now and turn on notifications to be notified for any video that I upload. Excuse me, and I'll catch you guys later in the next one whenever I start doing that. So hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. So take care.